Now was here behind me on her maiden voyage that she ran aground and was completely wrecked. Now to give you some idea of what to expect the first time you boarded the Schomburg, the first class passengers were met by beautiful velvet carpets, large mirrors and cabins lined with maple, rosewood and mahogany. There was a large library stained of oak with its own piano, pens full of pigs, fowls and even the ship's own cow for fresh milk and she also held 9,000 gallons of water for bathing and drinking. Now Captain Forbes had made a name for himself throughout the world for breaking different speed records and it was because of this he was given command of the Schomburg for her maiden voyage. Now it was custom before each ship left the harbour on the maiden voyage to hold a huge banquet and at this banquet would be the captain, the ship's owner and the ship's builder.